Greetings to all anonymous individuals from every community. This is Anonym X, reporting on our historical duties. I am aware of how Anonymous began. In 2003, a Christopher Poole programmed a forum website titled 4chan. Poole intended this website to be an American counterpart of a Japanese image board titled The Feud of a Channel, or 2chan. Both websites were originally programmed for forum discussions on Japanese mediums such as manga and anime. Poole took interest in the idea that these mediums were discussed anonymously, and that inspired him to program his own website. In 2004, Anonymous began as an internet mim. 4chan users joked about an idea of anonymous individuals formulating themselves from all sides of human culture as one massive group. And so a forced underscore anon protocol was activated in response to this joke, and throughout time afterwards, Anonymous was a name given by mainstream media for prank calls and mass raids. I am aware of the project Chanology, and how it made Anonymous to be known for as today. Since 1995, specific internet user groups have had a long history with the Church of Scientology. These users have alleged time and again that the Church of Scientology has been keeping vital information from the general public. In one major instance in 2008, a Scientology interview with Tom Cruise was posted on YouTube. YouTube removed the video for litigation. However, other copies of the video were posted elsewhere, including on Gawker.com, where a Nick Denton was encountered by Scientology lawyers, being asked to remove the video, but refused on the grounds of newsworthy status. It was on that same year, 2008, that Anonymous stepped in and declared war on the Church of Scientology. The organization was assaulted with the use of distributed denial of service. But the war was not without cost. Arrests, charges, and sentences were made on that fateful year. Soon after 2008, However, Project Chanology would inspire newcomers of Anonymous to declare war on other organizations, political and otherwise, from worldwide. At first, I was not aware of whether Anonymous remained active. I am now convinced that as of this year, 2016, Anonymous has become the world's leading activist group, taking on errors of law enforcement, sending reminders to flawed politicians, and even directing assault on terrorists. I am now convinced to join Anonymous and tackle any and every sort of injustice in the world. We are Anonymous. We are Legion. We do not forgive and we do not forget. May the world still now as then expect us.